Many traditionally male domains have in recent years opened their doors to women. But in Canada, there was one group that held out until a Human Rights Commission ruling this year forced it to change its ways. Bruce Cameron reports. For the past 20 years, this changing the guard ceremony on Parliament Hill has been made up exclusively of men. Mainly summer students, they were also potential combat troops. And Canadian defense policy says women can't be involved in combat. But this year, underneath those furry busbies are 11 women. The women are here only because a complaint was laid before the Canadian Human Rights Commission last summer. The commission ruled that an all-male guard discriminated against women who wanted the summer jobs. But the Defence Department still didn't want to put women into combat. The deal eventually worked out was to have the guards turned into a purely ceremonial unit. Most of its members, the men, still come from other militia units, but the women just join the guards. A compromise that's left everyone happy. It's not easy work. The constant drilling caused two members of the 180-person guard to faint during this evening's opening ceremony, both male. But military tradition requires that the ceremony go on. And that's what will be happening here every day for the rest of the summer. Bruce Cameron, CBC News, Ottawa.